course, we have many outstanding scientists at the Lady Davis, uh, which includes clinical researchers at the Jewish General. Um, so it's actually difficult to choose, but uh, Andrea was a pretty easy choice. She's been an outstanding scientist since she arrived here about almost 20 years ago. And uh, she's done some brilliant work that has got her some international recognition on a very important disease, Alzheimer's disease, which, with which I think everybody is familiar uh, realizes is a very important problem. And I think another unique feature of, of her work, which is attractive to, uh, to uh, the Lady Davis, is she's attracting uh, collaborations from pharmas, uh, Merck being the prime example at the present time, because the pharmas are all very interested in trying to develop drugs that will reverse or prevent uh, Alzheimer's disease uh, progression. I'm very honored to have been chosen for this award because the Institute has many excellent and outstanding scientists and uh, to be chosen amongst all of these is, is definitely an honor and I, I appreciate it very much. I'd like to thank, uh, of course, uh, the committee who nominated me for the award as well as uh, the Ju Jewish General Hospital and the Lady Davis Institute which have uh, created an, an environment that's really uh, productive. Uh, you know, there's been a lot more structure in how the Institute is run now and so we can accomplish things more rapidly, so it, that has been uh, amazing. I would also like to acknowledge um, all of my students, uh, research staff, technician, research associates and postdoctoral fellows because they do all of the work and if it wasn't for them there would be uh, none of this, uh, these findings. So lastly I would like to thank the foundation of the Jewish General Hospital and especially Meyer Bick and also Claude Krinsky who is the director of major funds for having attracted donors to give uh, some uh, funding to my laboratory and it's been very helpful.